everyone welcome to our channel uh, we just got back like literally yesterday from a trip to Florida and we spent lots of money on makeup so we thought we'd show you we got stuff from Sephora we went to we didn't actually go to Ulta no, this time because no. I think we pretty much got what we needed yeah. at like Walgreens and CVS so we'll just show you what we got um, we can't really give you that many like first impressions we've used like a couple of things mm -hmm. so we'll let you know what we have used yeah. and if you think that you might like a video of us using the products that we've bought in a little bit of a like update then yeah. let us know and we can do that for you yeah, too that's a good idea um, so shall we start maybe with Sephora? We'll we'll yeah. pick up a few yeah. things that we bought at Sephora and we'll we'll show you them. This up. Okay. Okay. So this is the It Cosmetics CC Plus Illumination. This is the illumination. No, one. no, it's not the illumination. Oh, it's not the illumination. Um, that's the pink one that you've got the illumination. Yes. One. So this is the normal CC Plus, and it's like a mini size from and um, like the Isle of Doom thing where they've got all the minis. And um, did you try this? Yes. Did you like this? I did like I like the illumination one. We just kind of like have like stuff that we both want to try. Um, so it's not necessarily like it's like yours or it's mine. Yeah, stuff. yeah. So but that pretty much is mine. Because I like the other one. Yeah. Um, but I want to try this one and yeah. see what it's like. I'll allow that. Okay. So that's the first thing from tomorrow. <laughs> Go. Um, <laughs> the next thing I'll pick up is this, which is the... Um, Elizabeth and James Nirvana perfume and this is the rose let's see what's it called it's good I think it's just, just called rose, just called rose. Got, like 50 different things written on oh, it yeah so. just literally rose yeah. um you weren't all that keen on it were you when I put it on she was like mm, it was very strong. overpowering yeah um but I like the I like I think the black one that I like yeah um and I do like the bourbon, but it's very strong. Yeah. Like, and this is a, it's kind of, it. I feel like this is a little bit like the bourbon, but it's like got that little yeah, bit Yeah, yeah, it is. It's a bit like scent. more like a floral. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. duh, rose. Yeah. <laughs> so the next thing, um, oh, let's do this. So this is mm. the, they had so many good mini things. They did, they? Yeah, really This does. is the Tartist Pro Glow to go by Tart. And it's like a little um, palette, kind of, isn't it? Like a little Lovely face palette. Lovely travel palette. Really, like, super cute size. Nice good for packaging. holidays. Good for holidays. I <laughs> like a little bit of an in joke because whenever we see like a mini, we always say it'd be good, for, good for holidays. Um, so <laughs> you've got. Are they both shimmery highlights? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think this top one's like more it's shimmery more, it's though. Kind of pinkier. Oh, maybe. All the tart stuff smells like vanilla. Yeah, it does. And mm -hmm. then it's so it's got more of like a champagne highlight, a gold highlight, and like a. I would say that's more of like a bronze. It color. is, yeah. Um, and that wasn't too expensive. I don't think. Oh, see, sometimes they have the prices on, but this one no, doesn't. I, don't I think this might have been maybe like some, twenty. Dollars yeah, things are like yeah, nineteen, maybe twenty five in a push. Yeah. Something. And I think that's a really good price for mm, that. Yeah. And they do like a big one with like two they do, leg sides, yeah, but I don't yeah. see why you would need anything else than yeah, the colours that are in yeah. there, really. I have had a little try of that and liking it so far. Yeah, I think it's lovely. Mm -hmm. Oh, um, we also picked up, actually we got two of these because um, my friend asked me to pick her one up as well, so that's for her. That's for is you, that the same Ali? colour? Yeah, it's the same. Yeah. Um, and this is a little NARS jewel, and if you watched our... What do we call video? it? Get ready. The chatty get ready with yeah. me video, which we'll link below if you didn't see it. Um, you'll see that I have a mini of the NARS Laguna, but I've hit pan on it quite badly, and I was looking for another one. So when I saw this, which has got, oh sorry, oh, blind. <laughs> we're able to see our garden, um, it's got the NARS Laguna um, blush, there's the bronzer one. and the NARS Orgasm blush as well, so it's a lovely little set and I think again it was like about $20 and I think it's really worth it if you want to try those two NARS products but you don't want to splash out on the original full yeah. size one, so really happy with that. Now from moving on from that yeah. to this tiny one and i got this it was a hundred point perk and this is just a little tiny oh blind you with the tiny mirror mm -hmm. this is a little orgasm blush you know should, oh, have you got the other one have you put it away i put it away just to compare the pan size because i think yeah. that pan is bigger than the other one it might be about the same i think oh it's 
the same? Yeah, no, I think the no, one you've got this is bigger. slightly bigger. Yeah. And it's worth noting that if you're there for like if you're away in well, where there's a Sephora for like two weeks or more, don't like go in the first time and like use all of your points. Because yeah, good point. I've still good point. <laughs> I've still got loads of points left. Yeah. And I think this was actually the only thing. Oh no, I'm lying. I did get a tiny little Becca um Highlighter. Shimmer and Skin Perfector yeah. in Opal. Mm -hmm. Um but I haven't got that here. I left it in America. Um so I'd only got this and that and they were two hundred points and I mean that's gonna last like forever. Yeah. Or a, well, a maybe not time. forever, but it's gonna last a long yeah, time. It so it's to oh. <laughs> <laughs> unless you throw. So it on the it's ground. totally worth just holding out because this wasn't there the first time we went That's in. That's right, yeah. And so then when we went back, I was mm -hmm. like, oh, I'll have that. So I didn't worth spend any of my points this trip. No, if you don't think I've got anything. like nine hundred points. Well, now, you've so. got a different thing from Becca. Yeah. And you obviously bought that with the two things in, yeah. so there was no point mm -hmm. you getting either of them. That's right. That's right. Yeah. So um. Yeah, let's show. We just went crazy yeah. for the minis. Yeah, um, that was a birthday thing. It was. Yes. yes, this was. Although I didn't use any points on this, this was one of the birthday gifts. Mm -hmm. Um, I think the other one was like a skin care yeah, set, that maybe. Was. Which I've got like really fussy skin, so I never choose I the like, skin care no, sets. I, don't I don't like the makeup sets. So this and Tarte is one of my favourite brands. Love Tarte products. I'm I got this was a, I got this as well because yeah. it's a birthday thing. So this is the the blush and it is in party. party literally party. party. <laughs> um, mine's all mine's getting a bit sad already because I've right. used it. Well, I, I think I'm going to use this yeah. one. So I really want to really try nice this as well. Like yeah. one of these. Yeah. Like I've really that. fancied one for a while. Be, isn't it? It's really nice. And again, that'll probably last quite a while. It will. So that's the tart blush and also this little mini lipstick. Is it like it's a, a liquid lipstick? Liquid lipstick. I think I might end up having that one off you as well. Do you think it's a bit dark for it's me? It's like the colour I like, like the mm. brownie, purpley nude yeah. colour. It's maybe it's not nice. quite. I did wear that between. one day. I liked it, but I didn't like it as much as my Kat Von D liquid lipstick. Which everything is. Just so you know. Compared to. Yes. Just so you know. Yeah. Oh, actually, off that. We have some of these that we got for Mum's friend as well, and this is one of the mini things again, and it's the tart. I think this is just called oh Tartus Lip Wardrobe Volume Two, mm -hmm. and it's got oh did we say what was that one called? Um, shade um I actually is... don't think. I hope so you don't mind you. if I birthday open, suit. I hope you don't mind if I open it just to say what. Alicia's that. opening your makeup. Um. Oh, these. Oh no, they are. This one is. Um, anonymous <laughs> just because it doesn't have a name. Oh, roll! This one's called Rose, and that looks like a nudie pink. Mm -hmm. Oh, four more, four more. Fear of missing out. And that one's like a uh, pink. A little no, bit more pink than this one. It's yeah. just a pink. So yeah. they're dead wearable colours. Yeah. And how cute is that little packaging? With the and shiny? again, that's like, I think it was 19 Yeah, totally not like much that. at all. So definitely worth picking mm, those up too. Absolutely. We'll keep them over there. Um, shall we, while we're on the subject of tart, let's yeah. go for the yeah. exciting stuff. <laughs> this was um, another set that was in the I Live Doom. It's not um, really Doom though, is it? Because it's the Isle of Temptation. Yeah. <laughs> this is the Tartus Treats box, and you've got the Lash Paint Mascara, the Pro to Go Eyeshadow Palette, and the Glossy Lip Paint in Wow. Wow. And the I was gonna pick the little palette up on its own because I've got the um, is it called Tartus? I thought that was something. Oh, this is the protocol. Yeah. That this was This is the protocol. Yeah. Um, I have used this like twice, I think, and it's really, really nice. I love it. They've, it's got some really nice, really nice shades. I in. wanted one of them. You did, but I you did. didn't. You I resisted so the I temptation. Resisted, yeah. Um, yeah, it's really, it's really Lovely. nice. It's kind Lovely of like colours. more pinky sort of shades. The other one I've got is more nude, so that's really nice to travel. Good one for your holidays. It's good for travel. Yeah. <laughs> and also has this little 
mini yes. mascara. I haven't tried, I have yet. actually, I've tried the lights, camera, flashes. Flashes. Splashes. I didn't, no, I didn't have the The waterproof one. one. I didn't like and that. I didn't love it. I didn't like that Everyone one. Everyone says it's amazing, but I didn't love it. Um, and this is the Tartus Glossy Lip Paint. Did we say what shade wow. that was? Wow. Wow. In wow. Let's see. So that is like the lip paints, but it's a glossy finish instead yeah. of like a matte finish, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's kind of, it's a bit Let's of see. a fall shade, Oh, that's think. nice. It's more of like a lip gloss. It is, which yeah. is my preference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I yes. think that's a lovely set. That's and wasn't really that nice. like literally like four dollars more than just the palette by It itself? wasn't much more, no, so definitely, it was definitely worth, worth it. it. I love yeah. that's why. So if you iron up the palette on its own, Get then maybe have a look yeah. for the set. And that is just a I think that's like an exclusive, like the mini so. palette, like the pro Tartus Pro palette. I don't think they're colours from there, are they? Because you've think got the so. mini TARDIS. And I've got the, but you've got the tartlet. Tartlet. No, tartlet. Yes. That's it. Yes. That is it. But they're not necessarily the same colours, no, I don't not. think. No, they're not. They're not the same. Um, I didn't realise <clears> you'd pick this up. But I'm going to steal that and you can have that. No. Because I want that. That's not This is <laughs> Becca Glow On The Go Shimmering Skin Perfector. And this was $20 and the value is $32. How do they work that out? Because I don't they know. don't set the It's probably per, like, per yeah. gram. And this has got the um like liquid. I think they're both just called Shimmering Skin Perfectors. Um mm -hmm. let me see. Shimmering Skin Perfector pressed in opal and it's tiny. And the other one. one's called Spotlight Spotlight Opal. Oh, so I don't think this is what I thought it was. I thought this was what they sell and um, like in the pump and oh, then you can right. mix it in with your foundation. Yeah. I don't know if it is. Is it this it must be the same colour then, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. They're both oval. Mm -hmm. Oh it smells a little bit chemically. <laughs> Looking forward to putting that on my face. <laughs> yeah, that looks nice. Yeah, so that's a nice I think that's set a really good well. set. And good for the price. Yeah, and, and good for travelling. And good for yeah. travelling. So I also picked up um a mini of the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powder in Dim Light. And I don't really use like a face powder very often. These are nice though. But these are really nice mm -hmm. and they're very light and she looks a bit like that, like a translucent y type powder. Yeah. But it's um it's very nice if you want a very natural looking powder mm -hmm. finish. Okay. So okay. the next thing we've got is the milk makeup blur stick and it's just like a little glue stick and it just looks a bit weird, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Like, um, it's one of those like blurring pore filler things, thing, yeah. and you just. I've put tried it, it on. once or twice. What do you think? Well, not worth the hype. It's difficult to tell. I need to use it at home. I think when you're using it, yeah, when you're on your holiday. But I was just thing. thinking about that when I was getting ready. I thought, you know, it's like hard to tell what works because yeah. obviously you're like you're not really natural, hot and sweaty. Yeah. So like. And if you're not in your natural surroundings and your natural lighting mm -hmm. for when you're putting mm -hmm. your makeup on, it's difficult to really tell yeah. if it's going to be I mean, okay. Yeah. So we'll let you know. Yeah. One more thing from Sephora. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You can't go to Sephora without getting a new beauty blender because they're a little bit cheaper yeah. in Sephora than they are And there's loads of them. On this every colour imaginable. Yeah. But I always stick to the pink one. Yeah. I like the pink one. So I've got a new one of them. I usually like to get the one that's got the like tiny little um, beauty blender cleaner in. I think in, stopped but doing them because them. they were too good of a deal. Because I like that little <laughs> thing. Blender cleanser. It's good for travel. It's good for travel. It's, good for travel. it's actually not good for travel because it doesn't come in a tub or anything. It's just a little bar of soap. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. That's oh, true. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now these are two sets. Now we love these sets, but we were good this time and we didn't pick any up, but we did pick some up for our friend. So um hope you don't mind, we're gonna open them. Um, <laughs> so this one is looks so good. I almost got this, yeah. but I was being really I know, and I, I was really tempted. Because I bought tons of home things and furniture. So I didn't buy loads of makeup and I'm just sharing the stuff that mum spent all of our money on. Um, so this is one of the Sephora's oh, Sephora favourite Sephora favourite <laughs> set and this one's called Sunkissed Glow 
bronzing and highlighting essentials and you get a Lovely. little makeup bag and this is like holographic see-through and that's really I mean the makeup bag itself probably oh and this is this is what I love is I've still got the sticker on $45 and it's $150 value so you get oh I thought this was what you got this is an ambient lighting bronzing powder in luminous bronze light and this is why I wanted this I know set. and that's why I wanted it <gasps> oh, too oh look it's so pretty and it's so small it's I won't so touch nice. it because it's not mine but it's lovely next thing now I think there's another bronzer in here so here it is yeah this is the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil very bronzer, very popular bronzer everyone which is loves so it so cute too with the packaging have you had this bronzer no I thought you'd no oh. I did have a Too Faced bronzer but it wasn't the mm. chocolate mm. Oh, oh, it does, doesn't it? It doesn't smell super chocolatey though, actually. Like an artificial yeah. chocolate smell. And this is like a classic Urban Decay half baked eyeshadow, which is just a beautiful, like kind of like it's a goldy nice. bronze. Mm. Really lovely. Sorry, I'm just catching how flat my hair is because I look like a little melon. <laughs> Um, this is this is full size. Full isn't size it? Marc Jacobs. Oh, Marc yeah. Jacobs eyeliner in. Rococo? Rococo. Ah. Rococo. And that is beautiful. It's Ooh, like it's a, a gel, twisty. is it? Like a gel? I think so. And it's like a little twisty. Mm. And that's just like obviously bronzy because that's generally the theme. What is this? Tarte Brazilians Plus Self Tanner. So I don't know if that's oh. for your fit. Actually, it's got on here what things. Um, it just says. Just says self tanner, so I'm I'm thinking that might be for your face because they've yeah. just brought out tons of like skincare yeah. type things, mm -hmm. haven't they? Um, and this is a Laura Mercier Radiant Foundation Primer. Nice. That's a nice size. Yeah, so, it is. Why didn't I buy this? I don't know. Should we tell her we didn't get it? Yeah. <laughs> and this is gorgeous. This looks like your kind of colour. It oh, it's orgasm, and that's the lip oh, gloss. Yeah, that's so nice. it's the pink with like the gold shimmery in. Oh. Why didn't we get this? Oh yeah, I forgot to get you that. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, we really forgot. <laughs> this is a milk makeup liquid strobe. So I think this is just like a liquid highlight. Yeah. But it looks like an eyeshadow, doesn't it? It does. It oh, looks it's like a roller ball. It looks quite top. thick, yeah. actually. And it's that? got a roller ball. It's got like a roller ball on the top of it. That is very strange. And I guess Sephora we've got a deal on these. <laughs> because they're a hundred point perk, they're yeah. in about five different sets, and yeah. they're in this one, and it's the Becca Shimmerance Confector and Opal, the yeah. little mini one. So how fab is that set for four, forty-five? Forty-five dollars. I mean really that's good. full size, that's full size, and they're the most like luxury brands in here probably. And then you've got loads of different things to try. That is so and nice. I mean that's fab, so yeah. I wish I bought that. <laughs> Good. It's I really do. nice. And good, good, good. also the this other thing that too. that was only thirty two dollars oh. is this sun what's it called sun safety kit. And again, this is something good that for holidays. It's amazing <laughs> for your holidays. And this is in this gorgeous Love bright that. orange with the little poms. pom poms. And we'll show you what's inside of here. I'll put this one here so we can look at what's Because they do still have this. them in Sephora, so you probably would still They had be able loads to get of them. these. Now, it's worth noting you had to ask for I that did, one, yeah, didn't you? I did, yeah. I did. Right, so the first thing we're pulling There's out There's tons here of stuff in here, by the way. Is the Resort Collection Sun Cushion Broad oh, Spectrum that's SPF such a 30. Shame it's in there. And more Pacific. Because I'm not going to open it. That is that there. Oh, it's like a cushion now, sun it's a cushion cream. sun cream. Now they do have them in the Isle of Doom. If you did want to try that, because mm -hmm. um, I think that's a really cool that's idea. Really good, isn't it? At first, I thought it was a cushion foundation yeah. with sunscreen in it. Right. But it's right. not. It's just a sunscreen, yeah. and I think they're quite expensive as well. I think so. Mm -hmm. And they've also got this Saint Tropez. Self Instant tan? Healthy Glow Body, Body Lotion, lotion. Oh, Gradual nice. Tan. Oh. I've got this. I've I was going to say the size of this. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. um, so that's really nice as well. And that's a great size to pop in your travel bag. Um, also, we have a Shiseido. 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 And this is a Sun Cream SPF 50. Water resistant. Yeah. For 80 that's, minutes. That's a great one as well. Yeah. That's a, 
That's really nice. I mean, I mean that must be so expensive. It's an expensive brand. That's yeah. the only problem with these. You like stuff and I then know. it's really expensive. Exactly. Yeah. Then you're forced to buy yeah. the full size yeah, yeah, and it costs yeah. you 200 pounds. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> um, this is an MD Solar Sciences Mineral Tinted Cream in an SPF 30. In like a I think that size. that is like from what it says on here, mm -hmm. it's a it's like a sun cream, but it must be like tinted, so right? A bit like a tinted yeah. moisturizer yeah. kind of thing. Um, we've got a Peter Thomas Roth, also a Max Shea All Day Moisture Defense Lotion Sunscreen, and again, I think that's just like a sun cream SPF 30. Yeah. There you go. I think that's in like a little that's a lovely oh, that's dispenser nice. as well. These are really good for like putting in your bag as well. Yeah. When you're going out. They are. Um, I mean, if you're going somewhere like Florida, like we've been, and you're going to the parks for the day, you can pop something like this in your little bag mm -hmm. and you can top up during the yeah. day. Keep that face covered. Yeah, put, put the extra on my nose yeah. and my head here because mm -hmm. I always get burnt there. We've got a Clarins UV Plus Anti-Pollution Broad Spectrum SPF 50 sunscreen. A little tube. Cute. Again, like Clarins, an excellent yeah. skincare brand. A Super Goop Set and Mist. Now, I've never heard of this 50. brand. They had a few things. They had Sephora, loads of nice stuff. Where did we see that really good set? I don't think it was Sephora. Um, it might have been um, in like a department store or something. Right. And it had, do you remember maybe, there yeah. was a thing and it had like a l anthropology? Yes. Anthropology that's right. had like a super goop set. It, well, I think it might have been that. It was a yeah. sun cream and it was a. Um, like a lip balm in a cheek yeah, tint, yeah. like in a little pot, That's and that right. was a lovely little set. Yeah. But I didn't see anything like that in Sephora. No, I didn't. Uh, we've got a Vita Libera, Vita Libera, yeah, and a luxury tan that. body blur. There you go. I don't even see that on this list. Oh, I must be able to keep that. Oh, one. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, sorry, it's there. Oh, sorry, no. sorry. <laughs> um, a cover FX. What is this? Clear Cover Invisible Sunscreen SPF 30. Mm. There you go. We have a Murad Invisible Perfect and Shield, which treats, blurs, and protects an oh. SPF 30. So it's kind of like a priming Let's sunscreen. See, yeah. mm. um, oh, and there's more. <laughs> I told you it was. This is Neogen. Mm -hmm. Not a brand I'm familiar no. with. Daylight Protection Sunscreen in SPF 50. Nice. And this is a cooler Daydream Mineral Primer. Um, I wanted to try some of their products. Oh, they have tons of really good stuff. Oh, I'm throwing that at you. Oh, that's gone. <laughs> and this here has. On earth. It just never it's, ends. It's non stop. We've got. Why are they in a little bag? Well, a teeny tiny thing, oh. right? What's this? Dr. Brandt Multi Performance Stick 5 in 1 Complexion Perfector. It's like a tiny weeny one. Okay, that one just says. I think it's. I don't know if it's tinted or anything. It may just be a sort Oh, and a Josie Marin um, Daily Moisturizer SPF 47. What? 47. 47. <laughs> there you go. Lovely. Yeah. Is that it? That's it. Oh no, no, wait, no, wait. Sure. There's more. There's a sugar. Oh. <laughs> My nemesis. <laughs> My nemesis. She doesn't like the way the screw top works. It's just It's like a metal container. It's horrible. It's, um yeah. The sugar nude fresh lip balm and that's an SPF 15. Fab. So that is such a nice little set. Mm -hmm. Also, just to tell you that Sephora donate $20 from each of the sales to mm -hmm. a skin cancer foundation. That's very kind yes. of them, isn't yeah. it? Right. So there oh. you go. So like I said, that's well, not ours. We got that for a friend, but we thought you might enjoy seeing what was in it in case you yeah, wanted to get really one for good. yourself. Definitely worth the money. So cheap. So let's move on to drugstore. We've got like a ton of things laid out in front of us. Mm -hmm. So let's start with the foundations, should we? Yeah. We were really interested to try this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation because we'd heard such good things about it. So we picked up one. You got one as well, didn't uh, you? Is that the lightest shade? Um, I think this might be the next one up because I think you got the lightest got the one lightest and I got one. the next one up. And it's it's quite strange because it's got this little like 
thing. How much is it? Like five dollars. Oh, it's five dollars. Like five dollars. That packaging's very like High luxury. Class, I mean, yeah. yeah. Um, I've used it. Um, I think maybe two times. Mm -hmm. And liking it so far. I liked it. I'm interested yeah. to try it here mm -hmm. at home so that I can really like test it properly. Yeah, but yeah. we'll let you know what we think. I like it. Um, yeah. Also, while we're on the Wet and Wild subject, I also picked up the is this the photo finish yeah, yeah. corrector as well? Yeah, photo focus, sorry, photo concealer focus. corrector. Um and I think this is in the lightest colour it is light ivory it's a, it's a lot lighter actually than it looks in the like pot when you yeah, put it I mean, on you probably can't see that no, because it's, it's gonna be just yeah. light i think yeah but yeah it is it's nice um i have like that i've well. used it i think i've only used it once but it you know it was comparable with what i'm using at the moment which yeah. is the nars one so i'll test that out a little bit more as well and we'll see how that goes um do you wanna yeah so picked up mom picked this up in her right color didn't you yeah which is 202 creamy natural because when we were there last time we could only get 201 and 203 yeah couldn't we? 201 was a bit pale 203 i've actually got on today because yeah, obviously i've brown i've yeah. got i've got a tan and you were probably noticing today wow Ellen, maybe wow, I'm so brown. They're so brown. So <laughs> bronze, like we've been away for two weeks. Yeah. Um, this, this is, is us with a tan. <laughs> I don't tan at all, so it's fine. <laughs> Infallible Pro Glow. Can't make one. Um, and this is lovely. Um, we've gone out about with loads. It's just a really glowy, it's like tinted like moisturiser kind of yeah. foundation. Very nice. Yeah. Um, one thing that I was really excited to get hold oh of was uh, the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer and you know let's be honest it's not cheap this. No like, I, I've, do you know what I've never is. bought anything from Physician's Formula because I look at it and then I think I don't love the packaging yeah. like it's not calling out to us oh, mm -hmm. and that's $15. Yeah, that's a like, lot really for a I mean, zone. let's put that into perspective. Mm -hmm. Like these things are like $19. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, I just... Can I but smell it is, though? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you can smell it. <gasps> oh my God, It smells like holidays. Shall we have a look at the other Wet n Wild stuff that we Go got then? then. Um, I'd heard quite a lot about this, which is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in Dolce de Leche. Tati says that that's like a Tom Ford Did one. She? Yeah. Oh, well, who am I to argue? No, no one. No, the only problem you is. Oh, you can't. We can't get it open. <laughs> it's really hard to get open. There you go. Yeah. You break your nails almost. That's lovely. So that. it's got this like bronzer here, and then. It's like a like a setting. It's kind of like a setting powder, yeah. I mean, it's it's like an under eye setting powder, isn't yeah, it? I would but say. I would say so. I touch it. You may touch it. Oh, it's very soft. Mm, it is. Oh, that's nice. Actually, it's not like cakey or anything. We also picked oh. up oh. a blush, a Wet n Wild blush. This is one of the ombre blushes, and this is in. The Princess Daiquiri. Oh, that's so I cute. I like that. And this is, you can see it's kind of like Ooh, more like, pinky yeah, at the top and then, like and then at the bottom. Yeah. Um, it's and it's very, very natural. natural. Yeah, it is. It's very natural. Well, that's nice. Gives you like a nice natural flush. Yeah. So that's nice. I like that. And we both picked this up, and I was so happy to see this. And um, the Wet n Wild Mega Last Highlighting Powder in Precious Petals. I think it was like there were two of those. There's two, but the other one was the deeper darker, skin yeah. tones. It was more golden. Mm. This is kind of a pinky champagne champagne. Yes. Um, and it's really lovely. It's very natural looking, and it's not like glittery. No, it's, it's it not. is glowy. Um, mm -hmm. and again, it was like so cheap. It was maybe like yeah. four dollars. Two dollars. So uh -huh. definitely worth the money, without mm -hmm. a doubt. Mm -hmm. Um, I also got this Wet n Wild skinny mascara. It's called Get the Skinny. This was like being Wet n Wild. It's like a few think, dollars, yeah, it and it's like this Ooh. very thin yeah, mascara yeah. wand. Um, it's I've used it once. I, I feel, feel like you like, don't like it. It's all right. Do you know what? I think <laughs> mascaras that you've got to use them a few times or like let them dry out a little bit. It's quite fibery. 
I was gonna say, say it's got like loads of fibres in it. Mm -hmm. Don't stink. <laughs> um, yeah, it's got loads of fibres. Yeah. It doesn't say anywhere on the front that it's got fibres in it. It doesn't. So it I feel says, like that's a bit misleading. It captures every lash and it's perfect for the lower lash line. I apparently. wouldn't think the lower lash line would be like a fibre. No, a fibre-y thing. No, no, no. definitely not. Um, so, we also got some Milani things. I do really like Milani as a brand. I think they're great. They've got some really good finds. I mean, we we all know about Milani Luminoso blush because it's holy grail blush. It's beautiful. And it might be an L giveaway that's coming up soon. But for me, I thought, I like that so much. Let's get something a little bit more pink as well. So I've got like the more like corally luminoso yeah. and this is called Dolce Pink. Very pretty. So nice. I, I think have these are that. like the um, hourglass ambient lighting blushes. Yeah, are, they're yeah. very similar. So I'm really pleased like, with Milani's that. Like Milani's and Chief either. It's alright. It's like so Not so, so but some of the stuff is a little bit expensive. And I've heard some good things about this which is there very similar to the um, Maybelline. Maybelline Instant Age Rewind. Dab shall, I just, shall I crack this out? Yeah. With the and then let's have a bit of a look at it. Like, oh, just God. put it on the sponge, because you might like use yeah. the sponge on you. Hmm. Don't know, the jury's out. The oh, jury's fair, out it feels nice. The okay? I will say, with Milani, I've never had any of their, like, base products, mm. because I think no, as a fit. brand, no, as a brand, I think they're maybe more suited to, like, darker skin yeah, tones. Yeah, they Which do. is great, because mm -hmm. I feel like... In England, there's nothing for dark That's skin true, tones, yeah. mm -hmm. but I think that their stuff isn't light enough for me. Yeah, I mean, that doesn't look all That's that the lightest light. That's, one, yeah. and it's not that light. I mean, you'll probably be okay with that, because um, you're a bit more tanned than me. Yeah, I mean, I don't know that I'd put that under, under my eyes, eyes cause yeah. it looks, no, I it's don't not brightening, think, I mean, is considering it? you like this one, which is the brightening, which is like yellow yeah. for the brightening, I yeah. don't Thing you would like, that. but I'll try it. Alright, if you it, know. it feels nice, it doesn't feel. He I mean, you've got loads on, and you put a yeah. bit on my hand. It doesn't feel heavy yeah. or anything. Well, this is the the brightening of the uh, Maybelline. No, it's not brightening. Neutralizing. neutralizing the neutralizing. The brighter ones are like pink. The one, brighter isn't ones it? are yeah, pink one. This is the I more like. yellowy one, which is the neutralizer, and this is my favorite one. And I've got another one that I've already opened because I'd run out. So this is me bag up. Um, and oh, I got a Milani mascara as oh, well. Oh, you got lots more Milani things. I did. This is the Lash Trifecta, and I've used this as well, and I really liked it actually. Mm. I, I kept it in the packaging just to show you. See how good I am. And this is what it looks like. It's like oh, a little bit. That looks a bit like roller lash yes, that I like. Yeah. yeah. It's a little bit like I like those bent. curved brush brushes. But it's <laughs> quite quite a thin brush as well, which again I like. It says it lengthens, it nice. curls and separates. Yeah. So I do enjoy that. Yeah. Right, what were you gonna say? You no, know, I was gonna say you've got two more Milani things. Oh right? yes, I do. All the Milani what do you wanna things. do one? Okay. Keep it smooth looks lip treatment sugar smooth. I thought I was gonna say scrub, but it doesn't. <laughs> no. And this, how lovely is that packaging? That looks really expensive. And this is the Keep It Sweet Sugar Lip Scrub. Oh, so this, this is, is the yeah, scrub, and that's, that's the treatment. That. So is that number two? It is. So what was number one? I don't oh, know. it was a lip um, product like remover. Oh right, yes, yeah, so her like a lipstick remover. Ooh. It smells very, very sweet. Have you tried these? Yes, I've tried them once. Just and this, yeah, it's just kind of a lip balm, this one, and it's yeah, more of a scrub, yeah. so. It's like a, tr like a, diff like a, what's well, maybe like a three step thing, yeah, isn't it? I think so, yeah. yeah. Should we do this? Yeah, go on. I've then. got this out the package. And I've got Have it. Have you in tried the it at all? No, not yet. It's strange. Oh, so okay. this is brand brand new. And it's again, we might have one of these maybe. in our giveaway. Cover girl total tease. Oh, this is waterproof. Oh, is it? It feels waterproof. Waterproof? Yeah. That's so funny, because I tried it and I was like, Jesus, this is <laughs> <dark enough." laughs> Now it makes sense. I wonder if they were all waterproof or whether the display only had waterproof because oh, there was definitely right. 
whatever, it's waterproof. Mm -hmm. So it's Tall Tees Mascara. And it looks like this, like, um, weird. <laughs> it does look like roller lash, doesn't um, it? I think it's kind of meant to be. And, um, <laughs> it's like, that's strange, isn't it? Can you that. even see? Um, I don't know if there's a picture on there that maybe you can see. It's me, like, I'll show you. Slight, it's not really curved. You can see it's got like it's a little It's only got a brush on, the on one side, and then the, yeah. uh, so the brush is on this side, and then on this side it has like a little, like a little curved bit that just has like about five or six yeah, spikes. Yeah, that's odd, isn't it? Now, I tried it, I do like it. I think it maybe needs to dry out a bit and then it would be really good because mm. I love the little comb and then the um the like little sticky out bit was great for getting like yeah. right in the corner yeah, yeah. and the edges mm -hmm. um so I think that I will like it but I think that it's one of those that maybe because yeah. I didn't love roller lash at first yeah. and needed it to dry out a bit and then I absolutely loved mm. it so I think that this could be a good one I also got from This is Cover brand Girl. new as well. It is brand new. We found like a display Indeed. on one of our last days in Target and that's the only place I've seen these products. This is the CoverGirl Melting Pot Gel Liquid um, Lipstick. Melting Pout. It's a play on words. Melting Pout. Melting Pout. <laughs> and this is in shade 110. Um, I don't think it's got a it's shade got a name. name, it's just a... Let's have a look. No, it doesn't seem to have a name. 110. One 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 oh, that's oh, what? Ev Evangel. Evangelical. Ev that's what it's called. That's okay. stupid. This is like the Too Faced things. Well, do you know what? I don't think it is. Yeah. You mean the, like, um... Oh wow! The, that's the what are they called? Melt just melted, melted lip things. Things. melted lipstick things. things. Are it's you not it now? no, oh. it's not like a melted lipstick. Mm. It's it's got a different right. texture. It's it is like a a gel texture, so it's not like drying. Doesn't really smell of anything. No, I really like it. Oh, that's beautiful. I, I love beautiful. Got some more. Oh. I might get some more. I'll have to get some more. I'll get some more in a few months. Yeah. But it's really nice. I've got some random things. Okay. Now I made a yeah. um I made a ColourPop order to be there when we arrived. Um but I didn't bring everything back. So there will be a blog post on all these ColourPop things, but with me now I have the ColourPop, you can't read what it says because it's white and it's got yeah. silver on cream gel eyeliner in mr bing and it's just like a gel eyeliner but it's like a it's a brown but it's like a ready brown yeah it's really nice i like, I like it that. and then I, well, the reason i placed the order was because i had like 20 percent off for no reason and i wanted to try these it's the color plop color plop <laughs> oh talking to me color pop <laughs> blotted lip and this is in the shade drip and it's much smaller than their normal lippy sticks um and if you watched our declutter you'll know i didn't love the like the actual, liquid lipsticks yeah. in various forms um and these are really cool they're basically like a sheer lip like product that. but you can build them up mm -hmm. and it's like a stain it's meant to be like popsicle lips they say all right and it's okay. really nice and oh, is that what you've got on today oh, I like i've that. worn it loads and i definitely want other colors because they're like four dollars five dollars this is like totally random really i'm just throwing this in um ma'am very nicely ordered us the new fleur de force for MAC lipsticks because it launched yeah. when we were away and we really wanted them. It's like a nude, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> and it's a cream sheen formula. Now, I've never had a cream sheen. And we like to we support. support yes, and we love Fleur Force, one of my favourite YouTubers. Um, and I just want, I've bought everything that she's brought out basically. Yeah. <laughs> I that's think it. that's everything, isn't it? And that it? is everything. Wow, that was a lot of things, was wasn't it? Things. So I have mentioned a couple of times about our giveaway, which will be coming up on our channel soon. It's a UK and USA beauty products from the drugstore, and we're going to 
pop them all in a bag and we're going to send them to one of you and we'll tell you all about how to enter the competition. We're just trying to figure soon. out like the best way yeah. to do the competition because um, mm -hmm. I know there's like a lot of different platforms that you can use to yeah. like, figure out what's the best way yeah. to do it. Basically. Yeah, and we'll pop on here, we'll show you everything that we're giving away and we'll give you the details of the competition. Yeah. So subscribe if you want to get notified when that's coming up. Yeah. And um, we've got vlogs coming up soon. Yeah. And in the meantime, thanks for watching our yeah. haul. We hope you've Thank enjoyed you. it. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.